I wasn't really paying attention. What do you say? Do you know how many times I've heard the Weera family speech? Trust me, the only person you should be loyal to is yourself. Yes, quiet. Hey, Rydell. Hey, just wanted to wish you both luck for the big race. You got this. Thanks, Pops. Just remember, don't just say shit. Win shit. Win shit. That's right. Well, break it. No, oh, I'm going with this. See you back at the garage. What was that about? Maybe he's trying to apologize. It usually starts with sorry. Well, that's just right now. He's old school. Yeah, old something. Yo, looks like Alex here. Do More tweaks and we'll be first next time, no doubt. Whew, that was such a buzz. Doing our thing, we belong out there. Born to race. We showed them we got the skills to compete. We gotta let Rydell know how we did. I can imagine his goofy face now, grinning with pride. Oh shit, hold up. Alex calling. What up, fam? 
Yeah, impressive, huh? Little garage run by. I told you, bro. I don't know, like a bunch. A bunch of what? What, tonight? Yeah, you know it. Thanks. Peace. All right. What was that about? Alex gig. Wait, now? I thought we were going back to the garage. Transport job. Simple pick up and drop off. He's sending over the info now. We're not passing this up. It's our time, yo. All right, fine. Let's do this. I don't know, Yaz. This seems sketchy. What did I say about taking risks? If we impress this guy, he'll reap the benefits. But there's no second chances. Do you have any idea what ride we're picking up? Knowing my boy, something legit. Yes, nice. You take it. I'll drive out to the drop-off behind you. On it. We're keeping this little job between us, right? Don't mind if I do. Let's not wait around. For sure. I can't wait to see what this thing can do. Shit! Damn it, Jasmine! Is this car hot? Uh, maybe. Let's split up. I'll meet you at the drop-off. Got it. Stay safe. Twenty-four forty, still at large, team. That suspect just lost us at University Central. Spread out and find them, team. Dispatch, we lost them. Pursuit ending. Yes, where are you? I'm at the drop-off and there's nothing here. Are, are you sure this Alec guy gave you the right address? Shit! Yes, the garage alarm just got tripped. Are you satisfied with this message? Screw it. I gotta get back to the garage. Calling Rydell's rides. Call back during normal business hours. Shit. Yo, it's Yaz. Leave a message and I might get back to you. Probably won't, but I might. Shit. Where is everybody?
Rydell, you okay? They emptied a lot. Wait here. Shit! I knew it. I told y'all. Jasmine, who is that? I don't know that dude. Yeah, let's go. They just said your name. Rydell, she was with me all night. Who did you tell about this place? I didn't. You didn't what? You didn't go to the Heights? Laugh about how trusting the old man is? Well, who's gonna trust me now? Hold up! Took your ass in when no one else wanted you. Whoa, Rydell, you gotta chill. Yes, wait. What the hell? Did she just take the car? Kia, she took everything. dead again today. Some old lady did come in for an oil change. She didn't have any money, though. Just samosas. Yours is in the fridge. Uh, well, I'm gonna lock up for now. See if I can make a few extra bucks on the side. Oh, uh, I did clean out the storeroom, and dude, you were right. That is a possum, not a rat. So, uh, <laughs> Yeah. He's still in there. Oh, hey, the, the book you ordered came in. Bro, if you ever need to talk, I'm here. I'll be in early tomorrow to open up, okay? Peace. All right. Who needs a ride? Hello, Rydell's Rides. Need a lift? Hey, name's Jess. Heard you might be a good person to call for a cheap ride. I'll hit you with the address and where I'm heading. No sweat. I'll be there soon. I was like, yo, bro. And yo, check this, bro. He was all like, if you know, you know, bro. And you know what I said? <laughs> bro! Hi, um, Tess? Yo! Yo, I'm running a little late, so if you could, uh. I got you. What? Do you have. 
have a pet chinchilla or like a possum or something? Uh, no. Why? Really? No reason. I'm just gonna crack this window. So, what's this address? Headed to this empty lot off the underpass. You know it? That was an old meetup spot for local street racers. Oh, you race? Something like that. Anyways, cops have that spot pretty locked down now. <laughs> the scene's about to get a big shake-up from what I hear. Wait, really? Mm-hmm. If you know, you know. And I know, bro. So what's up? You're in the racing scene but don't have a car? We'll just get rides. I also like being on time. Yup, does this thing go any faster? Five stars. Great conversation. Yeah, you should stick around. Might be worth your while. Yeah, maybe I will. Oh, look at you, scaring the poor citizens of Lakeshore. I haven't seen this many racers in one place in a minute. What brought everyone back out? The love of racing, bruh. The need to express oneself behind the wheel. And money also. Yeah, probably money. I forgot how much I missed this. <laughs> I can see why. I'm gonna do the rounds, figure out what's up. Thanks for the lift, Speedy. That's my car. Yes? All right, all right, focus up. Let's go. I'm glad to see y'all showed up. How many years has it been, for real? The man cracks down a little bit and we all bitch out? I thought this was Lakeshore. I thought this was a racing scene. Flex in with your super tuners and your muscle cars. That guy. Woo. What's it gonna take, huh, to remind you why we got into this? Stacks. Nailed it. Three qualifiers, high risk. You have a run-in with the cops, you take them on. You make it, and I will see you in the finals. The Lakeshore Grand. You want to win? Then you had better be the best! Seven days into the first qualifier! Earn your place! Yes! Yo, Speedy, you still want that five-star rating? Then show me what you got. Five stars? I got you. between you and Miss Monologue back there. What you saw back there? That's my car that she's driving. Weird. Looked like her car. 
that she was driving. She even had the front to keep the license. This is it, Rydell's Rides. Not bad. I think he's a little work. <laughs> so, this is where Yaz started off, huh? Get the hell out of my shop! Wasn't me! Whoa! Whoa! Kid? You triggered the alarm, sister. Hey! No touching! Sorry. This is Tess. I almost took your head off. Nice to meet you, slugger. Rydell, I saw Jasmine. She just pulled up at this meetup. You're kidding. She still had the car. And she's still with that same crew that jacked our garage, setting up some high-stakes circuit called the Lakeshore Grand. <laughs> Corny. With our car. I need to beat her. I need the garage. I need your help. Hold well, on, kid. Now, let's say you do this, okay? And you throw down with Jasmine, and you beat her in a street race. So what? So what? That's what this garage was all about. And now look at this place. We're fine. This yours? Didn't I say no touching? Mr. Rides of Rydell's Rides. Love that name, by the way. Full disclosure, I went to that meetup tonight looking for a racer. Then the cops showed up and I was like, the cops? <laughs> oh yeah, and the kid was crazy fast outrunning him. Now. I'm thinking, learn from the best. Listen, I got what you need, cash. And you two got what I want, a reason to win. How about I make an investment in this garage, rep you in the race, maybe open some doors. Come on, Rydell. I can win. We can bring this place back. I'm in. Just promise me, no matter what Jasmine does, you do it the right way. Deal? Deal. So, Rydell, got any rides out back? Welcome to Rydell's Rides. <laughs> <laughs>
I have some customers looking for a delivery that could help us earn some cash before the next race. Nice. Judging by this place, you used to race yourself. Oh, sure did. Man, do I have some stories about the old days. <laughs> oh, I bet. I have you know I used to run these streets. Oh, so you ran? On foot, I see. Yo, kid. Want to catch up about the scene? Uh, is this gonna be another one of those we did things differently when I used to race type calls? Back in the day, women wasn't a be-all and end-all. So it is one of those calls. I used to race against this real loud mouth. <laughs> I can relate. Whole race just wouldn't shut up. So one day, I throw down some stacks, called them out. Told them, let's race for more than just bragging rights. How about next month's rent? Oh, oh shit. What'd he do? Put his money where his trash talking mouth was. After that, side bets became the norm in the scene. Damn, Rydell. Remember, though, know your opponent. Don't be thinking you're better than you are. Fast way to lose a lot of money. Got it, Rydell. Thanks, boss. Appreciate you.
Eyes on suspect again. This chase is taking the scenic route, team. Cop just hit us hard. Keep on him. Suspect left scene entering Underwood Garden. Not sure how much longer we can keep with this. Street Punk escaped! Get over to Underwood Gardens. Oh. That's where we lost the burp. 2440 lost. I'm calling it. Hey, if you're cruising around the lake, could you pick up a car for me? A Buick Grand National. They wanted to see how fast they can go with a real driver behind the wheel. You know any? Wow, the dad joke energy is real today. Drop me a pin. Sure. A pen. Right. Send me the location. On it. And I'm pretty excited. The Regal from Hell. Classic 80s muscle. My pop's dream car. He called it the Corvette Killer. So you better make him proud. No pressure. <laughs> We've got six days to get into the first qualifier. Let's make some cash and pimp this new ride up to spec. I hear you. Oh, and I've been doing some digging. Sounds like the Grand is gonna be four stages, four different vehicles. Four? So you gonna loan me the money for those as well? Why is this starting to sound like a pyramid scheme? <laughs> Speedy, trust issues much? Did someone hurt you in the prologue of your life? <laughs> Wait. You've been digging into me, too? Nah. Game recognizes game. Don't worry. I'm working on scoring you a little side hustle. Maybe make a little extra something-something before the next qualifier? So you're my manager now. Manager? Ooh, I like the sound of that. But... Delivered safe and sound. Now that's how you drive. Customer so impressed he said he would follow us on Insta. Do we have an Insta? Is that a coffee machine? Didn't test that one up? Where? In the kitchen? No, 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 no. It's a social media account. Oh, right. That at Mr. Ride thing. Hold on. Okay, in. There's a video of a dog skateboarding and people.
dumplings out of expensive sneakers. Look, okay, I'll figure it out. No, she... Wait, hold on. She saw a dog skateboarding? Not the point I was making. Later, kid. Yo! I'm gonna do a little digging about Yaz and the crew she's rolling with. I have a feeling she isn't the only one behind the grant. Really? Wow. Um, I'm curious, what gave it away? The huge prize money? Maybe she's been giving rides to randos for cash. In your car. Anywho, I'm craving boba. Peace! Today at City Hall, Mayor Stevenson announced increased funding for the Lakeshore PD. Cars are causing havoc on our streets after last night's high-speed antics endangering the good citizens of Lakeshore, I'm pushing my no-nonsense-for-nonsense policy into action. Make sense? Nonsense.
some higher paying jobs if you're willing to get your hands dirty. Ooh, a little extra cash wouldn't hurt. But Rydell doesn't know won't hurt him, right? Yeah, because that worked out so well last time. Hmm? The garage got jacked. And now I'm trying to win my car back. Any of this ring a bell? Uh-huh. Ooh, 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 don't forget my cut. I don't want to have to break your thumbs. <laughs> JK, blood makes me squeamish. Well, I'm getting ramen and watching that new reality show where they put naked people on stage and make them sing for clothes. Season finale. <gasps> Maybe one of them will finally get socks. <laughs> See ya. Listening to news across the lake on KRS FM, the number one.
Large control. That felon just shook us on West Brooks. 2440 lost. I'm calling it. Hey, kid. How'd it go out there today? Not bad. Tess seems to be on it, so that's something. Good to hear. Okay, listen. You know Jasmine is going to do anything it takes to win, right? Yeah, kind of got that feeling. Okay, so make sure the car's performing. You gotta pimp it. Don't scrimp it. Pimp it, don't scrimp it? <laughs> yeah, you know, improve the performance of the car and earn some money. Oh, no, no, I get it. I just, I hadn't heard that before. Good, right? I might stick it on a t-shirt. Anyway, see you back at the garage. Whatever you say, Rydell. So, Big Shot, you find anything out about Jasmine and her crew? Not much, but may I just say, thank you for calling me Big Shot. Mm. <laughs> Don't push it. Sounds like Jasmine's running with the crew from Cyril Heights. They keep everything pretty low-key. I just know they have big money, so we better be ready. The Heights. <laughs> Don't worry. The kid will be.
press the cross button to confirm your choice. 